um, piece of um, contemporary choreography, which I promised you guys during your contemporary warm-up, which you did already, hopefully. Um, so yeah, this is a little different, um, true to contemporary, which is usually off the wall. Um, this piece kind of inspired me, it reminded me of um, toys coming to life in a toy box, like Toy Story. It's been good if I had this last year. Um, so yeah, it's different in that it's contemporary choreography, but also the format. So um, instead of before I was doing a chorus verse, chorus verse, which is um, beautiful for jazz, uh, contemporary is a flow. So instead of doing it, chopping it up into pieces, um, I'm going to do the same piece of choreography three times. So um, yeah, you're doing it all the way through, and then you won't really hear a difference in terms of the music, what's dictating what you're supposed to be doing. Um, so just you're going to get to the end, and then again, of course, like always, I will do a breakdown, and uh, then you can try it again, and it'll make a little more sense. Okay, so it's different format, be patient. There's some really crazy ground floor stuff, so be careful, make sure you got a lot of room for this one. Um, we're going to do some movement. Okay, enjoy!
Okay, let's break it down. So like I explained before, a um, little different format because um, it's not course, verse, course, verse. It's all just one piece. So you're going to start with your feet <laughs> shoulder length apart, and you're going to go head, left, right, hold it right, and then you're going to tendu out and come back in. You have one with your left foot ronde jambe terre, around and in, and then you're going to contract, and there's a lot of stability, a lot of control in the stance. Six, seven, and eight, and then we rebound. One, you're going out to the side, turn out. Two, three, and four, and then we go over our head, and there's another stability right back to back. This one's a little harder. Go deep into your bends, demi-plie, and then you're going to come up with your back and take a big step out to the back, okay, with your left leg. Now here, big figure eights. Make this huge. Drop as much as you want. You're going three, and then swing that arm up. So your back arm, your left arm towards me is coming up and flexing your foot, and then you're going to do very staccato military walk. Développé, turned in. Développé, développé forward and back, and then two, changement, changement. Now you can really see the difference in this. This is why I love the music, is because it really dictated dynamic. So you're going to come down, and this one's a really lazy rebound all the way to the center six seven and eight now sorry you're going to pull into fifth position and your arms are going to come up to center and this is again really showing the dynamic staccato two three four and then relax six seven eight staccato two three four relax six seven eight now backwards we go left leg right leg go on that ma and then again kick and rebound and cross, point your toe as you come out, and then your right leg comes out. Let me show you that again. So everything should be okay to hear. This is nice and relaxed. Five, six, seven, we go. Tondu. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. Now we're here. We're going to shift our weight over towards that side, and we're going to bring the arms up. Take a second here. Here, I think one time I did a moon salutation. Whatever you want here, and then we go. Rebound and bounce, rebound and bounce. One with your knee, contract. Lots of feeling here. Contract, send it back, and then knee comes up and around. So I think I did that two different ways. Um, but yeah, you just want to get that knee up and around. And then here's a twist. So um, we were working on uh, rotation in your contemporary class, doing rotations with your attitudes, things like that. This is your rotation right here. Boom. So my hips stay straight, but my ribs turn in. Rotation, rotation, and then I go all the way around and up. And then this is your ground part. So you go down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Head goes one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We roll onto the back. This is going to be a half split. So you go half split and come back. And then both legs together. So much abdominal control. And then you're going to flip yourself over. So that all happens pretty fast. Now my right leg's coming up. I do a wild thing pose, which we did in your um, warm up, your technique. And then I come back down and I lift myself up, kind of do a walk around. And then you come back. So the only difference is when you see the choreography, you're going to notice I don't do the head part again. I go right into rendez jambe à terre and contraction and lift. Okay, so um, if anything, I, a lot of, again, it's contemporary, so um, don't get hung up on the counts. It's different than jazz and tap and any other uh, format that has to be really diligent about the timing. This one is really um, just feel the music. Feel what feels good. Learn the choreography loosely. It's really, um, I did this choreography thinking about keeping in mind you guys at home um, and things that you need to keep working on to keep yourself a comfortable dancer. Your balances, okay, and your rebounds, your kicks, using your turnouts, all those kind of things. So it's more, um, uh, let's call it a technique choreography, okay? Enjoy. I miss you guys. See you guys next week.
Maybe I was not properly socialized. But when you drag me under, when you pull me over the line, that's when you really reach me. I never knew.